There it goes. Hi everybody, Team Terry here. Hey! I'm Dave. I'm Kimberly. We're here to do, uh, we've been challenged by uh, Tom and Laurie, Tom and Laurie RV Life, uh, to do the uh, 10 question challenge. So uh, here we go. Um, number one, it says if you could change one thing in your RV, what would it be? Oh, that would be the bed, definitely. Bed. Yeah, the bed, it's too small. Yes. I like to sprawl out. Plus, our dog likes to sleep with us now, and our kitties and stuff like that. So, yeah, it'd have to be the bed. It's got to be bigger. Definitely. Uh, number two, what was something you didn't expect with your first RV? Okay, so what was our first RV? Our first RV was a Class C uh, motorhome. Yes, I remember that. 27-footer. Um, uh, it didn't have any slides. I think it was a 1987, I believe. Um, yeah, it was a 1987. It was a nice motorhome. Um, <laughs> the only thing we didn't expect was how much gas that thing used. It had a big Ford engine in it, and I mean, uh, instead of miles per gallon, it was more like gallons per mile because that thing <laughs> sucked it right down. Yeah, my thing in that would be also be the bed. Yeah, that it was a weird bed. Yeah, there was a bed in the back, in the back corner, and then there was a big king-size bed over the top of yeah. the um, driver, the cab. Yeah. And it didn't have a slide. So what's the next one? What was the deciding factor of buying your first RV? The first RV? Yeah. Oh, uh, we just wanted to go camping. Yeah, we love, both of us love camping, so uh, we, were, we were really, we weren't really looking seriously about purchasing one, but we found one that we really fell in love with, and we said let's do it because we didn't really want to tow anything, so we bought that Class C. And we liked it. We would yeah. love to go back to a Class C. Yeah. The next one is uh, your favorite meal when camping. Oh, so when we're camping and we're off the grid, and you have the cast iron pan, that would be my steak, potato, onion, over the flames. In over a cast the, iron uh, over pan. the grill, yeah, outside, not on in uh, the stove or anything like that, but outside on the wood fire. Yeah, we did that up in the Adirondacks in upstate New York. Uh, it was great. We didn't have no electric. We have a generator and everything in our motorhome, but out there it was peaceful, quiet, it was beautiful. Um, so we basically did it over the open campfire. It was great. We The cast iron pan came in so handy. Yeah, so what's the next question? Our next one, what's your must-see destination uh, while you're RVing? My must-see is Yellowstone and Mount Rushmore. Yep, yep. That's going to be our next trip. Um, we're hoping um, we're hoping with my cancer that goes into remission, I'm really praying hard, and I know a lot of you people that watch our channel are praying for me, but I'm hoping uh, I go into remission January, February, March, somewhere around there, I'll be happy. Um, and we want to go west, we want to go to Yellowstone and uh, the Grand Canyon, and I want to see Grand Tetons. the Grand Tetons and all that information. Uh, South Dakota, we didn't go through that when we were out west. We stayed down south. It but, was too cold. Yeah, but we want to do that. Um, Next question. Our favorite thing for RVing. What do you mean our favorite thing for RVing? Favorite RV? thing. Um, you mean like a utensil or? Whatever your favorite thing is. You got, like Tom and Lori, they were saying that she had a little electric heater. That was her favorite oh, thing. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, my favorite thing in the RV would be solar. Uh, uh, yeah, solar. <laughs> and uh, another important thing was um, our um, Instant Pot. Yep. We love our Instant Pot. Instant Pot was good. The least favorite thing? Is that the next question? Yep. So the next question number seven, seven is our least favorite thing. Oh, least favorite thing. Oh boy. I would have to say the bed. <laughs> uh, I'd have to say we got the uh, learning to use our composting toilet with peat moss. I, oh yeah, we didn't like the peat moss. I didn't moss. like peat moss. After a while, it gave me a funky smell. So, <laughs> so we're trying uh, 
What are we trying now? We're using pine pellets. Pine pellets, pine pellets we're using um, now. We ran into a RVer. Um, life uh, life, life is, a joy. is a joy. And he showed us how he mixes his up in his composting toilet. And there's no odor or anything. You actually got a little bit of a pine smell, which is great. Which I don't mind that. Um, Question number eight. Number eight. Must have on your next RV. Oh, king size bed. <laughs> king size bed with solar. And an oven. And an oven. It's got to have an oven. My wife does stuff in the oven, so we like that. Yep. Um, favorite beverage at camp? <laughs> oh, that would be whiskey. Yeah, we like to have everybody's got. When we met up with. Uh, Matt and Maria on uh, RJ's Adventures and all them out in Forsyth last year. And Tom and Lori of uh, Tom and Lori's RV Life and uh, the, what are they, the something Canucks. Canucks on Wheels. Yeah, Canucks on Wheels. Becky it's always and Byron, happy hour. Right? Happy hour, yeah. Byron and uh, Becky. Becky. Uh, always happy hour. Uh, so we always had our whiskey for a happy hour. That could um, start any time of the day. Any time. <laughs> Favorite indoor accessories. Number nine. Number uh, nine. That was number nine was the favorite beverage. Number oh. ten is favorite indoor accessories. Number ten. This is number ten. The favorite indoor accessory. Favorite indoor Oh you answer that first. I gotta think about well, that. Well we one. have favorite. We have uh our Something that you haven't booster said. For internet. Yeah, yeah, they you have. We have the inverter now that we didn't have before. Um, I don't know what else. TV. <laughs> Gotta have a TV. A lot of people say, oh, we don't watch TV, but you go buy their RV and you see it on at night, so <laughs> they, they might fool you, but uh, you take a walk at night, you see a bunch of them on. Um, it's good to help you fall asleep, too, I guess. I don't know. There's not really much my favorite, really. Well, someone decided to start stalling. Somebody, somebody's working. It quit raining here. We're here in Florida. Yeah, we're here on... Uh, Hernando Beach. Hernando Beach. You can see right behind us is the... The water. The there. water, the canals, so... Yeah. We're at my sister's house. So yep. She was thankful. And they all... My other sister... This is where our home Daytona. base is, so... Yeah. What's not the, here, but we're Was that to question number 10? Yep. So now we have to challenge uh, other uh, YouTubers. Yeah. So the first one we're going to challenge is Roll. rolling with the Bowlins. Yep. Number yep. two is destination open road. You can do number three. Number three is Papa Drew's RV Live. Number four is his and hers vlog. <laughs> and I'd also like to do couple extras just to make it camping with the Kellys and the wandering Gants. The wandering Gants. All you right we look forward to seeing you guys and, uh, I guess and I, I'm keeping up the fight so keep the prayers coming. Yep he's doing good. Had a, a pet scan and the, all the tumors are shrinking. Yeah. All right so we will catch you on the road. Catch you on the road. Bye. See ya. I take that back. Well, it's Tom and Lori. <laughs> See ya! <laughs> yeah. See ya for Tom and Lori! <laughs> uh, Alright, let's go. Thank you for watching. Make sure you subscribe if you haven't already. Make sure you leave a comment. Yeah, leave your comment. And thumbs up. Yeah, and give us a big thumbs up. And share with your friends and family. Right. And we'll catch you on the road. Yes, catch you on the road. <laughs>